Welcome back to Healthy Habits. I'm Brooke Evans. I'm Marissa. I'm Rashad. And I'm Gavin. Today we're going to discuss nutrition. <laughs> nutrition is a huge part of living a healthy lifestyle, as well as maintaining exercise throughout the week. Marissa is going to go further into detail explaining how to have a healthy diet, Rashad will explain the risks, and Gavin will explain the benefits of maintaining a healthy lifestyle. Hi, I'm Marissa, and I will be talking with you about maintaining a diet and how to start one. So, learn to expose excuses and eliminate them, like the I'll start it tomorrow or I've been getting better has to go away. <laughs> Get disturbed, leave your comfort zone, put clothes on that you used to fit into, look at clothes you wish you could fit into, let there be a drive passion for your diet. Do something totally different. Along with the diet, start something new, like an art class or something spontaneous. Let everyone know that the new you is coming. Make dieting convenient. Make it easy for you. Stack the fridge full of low calorie food, exercise equipment, and get a scale. Keep a notepad handy to write down easier ways. Uh, just track, keep uh, tracking everything you eat for a week and then keep track of your weight and the food you take in. <laughs> or you can take a professional uh, approach to your diet, like a personal trainer, a nutritionist, dietitian, someone to help you keep on going on the right track. Hi, I'm Rashad, and I'm going to talk about the risk of having a poor diet or not enough nutrition. Having a poor diet or not enough nutrition can lead to you being out of shape or, or having an unhealthy weight. Having a poor diet with low amount of nutrition can lead to many diseases and many bad health conditions. One condition it can lead to is being overweight and obese. If you don't have enough nutrition in your diet, you're going to keep eating unhealthy, unhealthy food and going to gain weight and eventually become obese. Not enough, not enough nutrition and a poor diet can also lead to high blood pressure, diabetes, and heart disease. Obesity is one of the main, main things that causes high blood pressure, diabetes, and heart disease. Some other diseases that having a poor diet and not enough nutrition can cause is type 2 diabetes, constipation, oral, oral disease, and many different types of cancer. Hi, I'm Gavin. I'm here to talk about good nutrition. Good nutrition helps your body function to its fullest. While dieting does mean eating less, it does not mean you will have to give up your favorite foods. You will just have to eat them in moderation. While dieting alone does benefit your body, pairing good nutrition with regular exercise, you will notice immediate changes in your mood and energy. Exercise and diet increases blood flow through your body and reduces the risk of heart attack, stroke, and type 2 diabetes. The health benefits and reduce health benefits and reduces risk are only half of it. Working out and dieting can help you feel better about yourself. It helps you lose weight and then boost your self-esteem. <laughs> the goal of eating a healthy, nutritious diet. Starting over. Take nine. The goal of eating a healthy, nutritious diet and exercising will help benefit you and reduce your risk of diabetes, heart disease, obesity, and other chronic diseases. It will also help you achieve and maintain a healthier lifestyle and live a longer, fuller life. Stay classy from Healthy Habits.